Hi guys, welcome back to my amazing kitchen. And if you are new here, kindly click on that subscribe button right now and join the amazing family today. In this video, we are going to be making some delicious pomegranate tea. This is so yummy, you are going to be making it all winter. So come along and let's get started. We need just two ingredients for this tea, some yummy ripe pomegranates. To be honest, I just select them based on my feelings. I have no tips and tricks to pick the perfect pomegranates. And we need some sugar. And all we do is to cut the pomegranates into two. And we are going to extract these beautiful pearls from the pomegranate. How I do that is by using my tapur or tapoli or you can use uh, your rolling pin, you know, anything that will help you bash on it to extract all the beautiful pearls. And this is how it will look after you've extracted all your pearls and you can continue by using your hand to take out the ones that did not come out on their own. Now with your hands, just pick out the membranes from the pearls, you want to separate it. And this is really important because if you don't do this, they are going to float on top of your tea. Well, unless you are going for pomegranate and membrane tea, please go ahead and leave them there. <laughs> but no, we don't want that. So you want them clean and beautiful like this. And once they are cleaned, you want to add your sugar and you are going to uh, mash it with your potato masher or once again, I'm using my tapoli. Now the sugar is here for three things. It will help bruise the surface of the pearl so you can extract a lot of juice. It acts as a preservative but also as a sweetener. I find that this amount of sugar that I use is perfect for the amount of pomegranates I used. But you can use more or less. Next, you want to transfer the mixture into a very clean bowl, an airtight container or a mason jar, sterilized jar, you know, anything with a lid that is airtight will do perfectly well. You are going to cover it and store it in your fridge and it will last you up to about a month. And that is if you are lucky because this tea is so yummy, you are going to be drinking it every day. So it will be gone really quick. To make the tea, just scoop some of the mixture into your tea glass or mug. Scoop some of the juice into it as well. Next, you want to go ahead and pour over your hot water. You want to stir and let it steep for about a minute and go ahead and enjoy your tea. For the children, I strain it before I give it to them because you don't want them to choke on the seed. So that's very important. For myself, I like to add a few slices of ginger into my glass, scoop some of the mixture into it, add a little bit of the juice, add my hot water, stir, allow it to steep for about a minute, and then enjoy my tea. The ginger adds another layer of flavor to it. You really need to try this simple tea. So if you have some pomegranates lying around and you have no idea what to do with them, just go ahead and make yourself some tea you will really, really enjoy. Thank you so much for watching, guys. And see you in my next video. Bye.